Victoria visits when she has breaks from school. Well, last week we introduced you to a Lodi woman behind a new online and print publication that reports only the good news coming out of her hometown. She's back working on more great stories. Cody standing by with the details. That's right. She's like the Energizer Bunny, but yeah. for good. Oh, she's amazing. I love it. All Doing right. good. For those of you with the love of books, there's a new little free library to check out. Jamie's mm -hmm. back with us. She's got a couple that have added uh, something to this new location. Hello, Jamie. How are you? I'm good, thank you. I like the Energizer Bunny uh, comparison. <laughs> <laughs> So I'm here with um, Dave and Virginia Markin, and they're actually one of my favorite stories. This is one of the first stories I did. And what they did is they did a little free library. So Dave and Virginia are huge proponents of education and feel like reading is one of the most important things that kids can do. And so they were wondering how they could make a difference. And when I spoke to them, one of the things that really resonated with me is they said, just one thing at a time, what's one thing that we can do to make a difference? And so the one thing they did about a year ago is they started this little free library How and it cute. has just taken off. I know. So here's Dave and he's going to explain it a little bit. Thanks. Yeah, it, we, it's been just about eight or nine months mm -hmm. and we got a grant from the ABCD, which is Asset Based Community Development. And so here in the Heritage District, there's an elementary school just down the block and we made a decision because education is so important and the key to education is reading. And so we committed to have this little free library only for elementary age kids, pre-K through sixth grade. So all of the books are for those age groups. And it's been such a success mm -hmm. that we have actually given out over 800 books in about eight or nine oh, wow. months. It, we refill yeah. about 60 to 80 every single week. That's amazing. Um, one of the favorite things I was saying is they have kids that come to the door and make special requests for books because, you know, kids are not shy, so they'll just come right up asking for things like Captain Underpants and things like that. <laughs> um, and yeah, just going through 60 to 80 books a week just because it's so popular. Um, they actually, when they did a grand opening, they had a second grade class come and they wrote them a bunch of really cute thank you cards. Oh, you can actually, so if you want to open it up, you can see them coming in. Yeah, they had the cat in the hat come read to them. Um, and it's just, it's been such a hit. So one of the things that we're encouraging people to do for the random acts of kindness is if you have a free little library and you want to drop off a book, it's just some way that you can get invo involved and give back. That is awesome. You were awesome. This is all awesome. <laughs> I'm just loving it. I'm just loving it. You I have a awesome. little free library in front of my house uh, as well. Mm -hmm. uh, but we've got uh, adult oh, books awesome. and little kid and books little, all yeah. mixed up in there. That's all the thing. Well, thank fun. you very oh, much. Perfect. We'll check. We'll keep following so you, know you around. You know how cool they are. <laughs> I know exactly. We'll keep following you Great. around. You're up to some good <laughs> stuff, my friend. All right, back to you guys. Thanks, Code. Thank you. The red.